it's like a war. We're fighting this invisible enemy, the virus. I am one of the generals, but it's more stressful to be soldiers on the front line. I'm seeing a lot of bravery and a lot of courage at our institution every day, every hour, where our doctors and our nurses and others are just performing extraordinarily in, in the face of adversity. Fear and anxiety is normal. When you're in the midst of providing care for these very sick patients where there is some personal risk because it's an infectious agent, you utilize those emotions to perform your task in an outstanding manner. When it impairs your ability to perform, then you need to take a time out. And you can get support so that when the time comes for you to go back into the fray, you're prepared again. There's also a moral compass, a sense of purpose. And I, I've heard this a lot from our staff. And that is, this is what they are trained to do. This is why they became a nurse or they became a physician. And a lot of them have the attitude, if not us, who? Who's going to do it? And they say, we're going to do it. Our doctors and our nurses do have a sense of optimism that they're up to the task and ultimately we will prevail. We'll look back and say, if I could win the fight against COVID-19, I could deal with any challenge going forward. And I think they will look back upon this time and place as being their finest hour.